Blame sugar, not fat, my friends. Since the 1960s, saturated fat has been the scapegoat for sugar's crimes. This can be contributed to the powerful private interest groups representing the sugar and the vegetable oil industries. Let's talk about a JAMA Internal Medicine published article that examined documents showing how the Sugar Association paid Harvard scientists to publish a review of research that was handpicked by the sugar industry and published in the widely respected New England Journal of Medicine. This research hid the link between sugar and heart disease and shifted the focus to saturated fat. Or in a similar plot, pioneering scientist journalist Nina Teicholz found that Procter & Gamble, the company that owns the vegetable shortening brands Crisco, funded the American Heart Association in a scheme to influence their recommendations to replace animal fat consumption with vegetable oils. Follow the money. It's not about your health, people. It's about the dollar signs.